So I have a friend who wants to say hello to YouTube. And <laughs> she's so proud of me because I have big news for you guys. And that's what this video is going to be about. Hazel, you want to say hi? Come here. Come here, Hazel. Say hi. Say hi. Look right there. Look right there. Look. <gasps> hi. <laughs> Thank you. Hold on, guys. I'm going to let them back in the house. Okay, so I have big news. So in case you can't see, I look a little bit dolled up more than usual. And there's a reason for that and I'll get to that, but first let me explain what has been going on. So I um, have an internship now and it's with a PR firm and also a casting company and so like once a month they make me come out and we do an acting class and then so I went to the first one you remember the last time when I was sick and then I took he took my headshot at the end of class and then he put me in the casting for um, a TV commercial and I just was like oh you know he's gonna put my picture in but you know I don't really care I don't think nothing's gonna happen so then, on New Year's Eve, I literally got a phone call from him, and he's like, guess what, you got the casting, and yada yada. So, um, it's really funny that I got it and stuff, because, like, acting is not something that I really see myself doing professionally. I mean, I don't mind doing it, but it's like, um not a huge passion of mine like writing or you know PR work but in a way I feel like it's helping me um, prepare for PR work and stuff because um, like as far as acting goes I don't really have much experience like I was a extra in the movie Street Dreams in case nobody knew that and you could um, probably look up the trailer and if you pause it on one of the scenes you'll see my whole family my mom dad and my sister my two sisters and me in it and um but that's like basically the only film experience i've ever had and then i randomly was in you know the life of ryan um trailer for on mtv and i think i was on tv for the do tour but it's not like they gave me a personal shout out and like people knew me and stuff, but like, you know, I was in part of the pan out crowd scene or something. But basically that's like my entire TV experience. So like when I got this call, it was like really, I was so like happy because it's like they said, oh, they like the way you look. And I was like, oh wow, I have a look for TV. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, in high school I took drama and like I kind of always wanted to do acting but it's like something I put on the back burner because after I did drama class I kind of didn't think that I had enough talent for it but as far as talent goes I don't really know if I'm gonna pursue it per se but right now I'm just having fun with it and it's cool because I got to do a today I went and shot a commercial that they're gonna use for Home Shopping Network for an ottoman product that they have and I am actually sitting on the ottoman right now. The thumbnail for this video is the picture but I'll probably put um, some pictures from, I'll post them on Twitter and then put them in the description. And um, or maybe even just on my blog. But like, uh, it's really comfortable this ottoman to sit on and also it's um, you can like store stuff inside and it's like very versatile and 
that's basically what I had to do for the commercial was I had to just talk about the product and, you know, ways you could use it and give a testimonial about it. And then I also get paid. I get to keep the ottoman and I get paid for my time. So this is really cool because, you know, I've been unemployed for like eight months and now I finally got some type of work other than doing surveys at home. So this is very uh, God blessed and I feel like a beauty queen right now with my TV makeup on and my TV hair and like the lady who did my hair was actually, she was a makeup artist for our Miss Florida and for other celebrities as well. So it was really cool. Just the whole experience. And um, that's basically it. So I'll let you guys know when it's going to be on TV when I find out. And yeah. And my internship is going good. Like, there's been a, not a lot of PR work so far, but I'm sure it'll pick up. And, um, but I've just been having fun. Last night was the next, um, class for the acting class. And, can you guys hold on? Sorry. Oh, all right. And then, um, <laughs> never mind. It was really fun because I feel like I watched, um, my favorite show on TV right now is Hard Dixie. Um, I, like, got obsessed with it. I watched it on Netflix at a friend's house once and then I just started watching the whole show and it's, like, amazing. Because I just always have loved Rachel Bilson. Like, I just thought she's so talented and so pretty. And, um, the show is really cute, though. Because she's from New York, and then she um, moves to a small town in Alabama, and it's like, it follows her there. And how people react to her, because she's from a whole different, like, the New York culture and stuff. So, it's funny. And her New York style, and whatnot. But, um, yeah, and then after that, on Friday, I watched Whose Line Is It Anyway? And I got some improv, like, I watched them do improv obviously I've seen the show before but then um like watching them I kind of that's what I use to channel like their don't think about it just do it kind of attitude in the class and that's what I did but basically um that's about it so I'll let you guys know um when it's on tv thanks for watching Lots of love. Bye.